Well, another question that's been asked is if you would comment perhaps on the, on the phenomenon of nonprofit health insurance companies. In North Carolina, we have Blue Cross Blue Shield in North Carolina, which has 96.8% of the market in the state, but it's at least in some theoretical sense a nonprofit still, and they profess to be for health care reform, but not a public option. Any particular spin as it relates to so called nonprofits? Yeah, uh, and I, I do talk mostly about for-profit companies, but there are still some very, very large non-profit uh, insurers like Blue Cross Blue Shield of North Carolina uh, that, that dominate markets. And that's one thing uh, that, that you all need to know. Uh, the insurance industry will say that you have a lot of choice. There are 1,300 health plans around the country. There's nothing like that. Almost every market is dominated by one or two or three very, very large health insurance companies. Uh, uh, and certainly in North Carolina, there's great concentration uh, with Blue Cross Blue Shield. Uh, they, they play by the same rules the for-profits do, quite frankly, uh, and it's to their advantage to do that. They call the extra money something else. Uh, they don't call it profit, they call it surplus. But, uh, you know, it's a matter of semantics, uh, frankly. And they don't want a public option for the same reason that the big for-profits don't want a public option, at least publicly. They don't want to have the threat of another competitor that might have the strength to compete with them in the marketplace.